How to log into the Big Blue Button web conferencing facility. First, uh, start off by going to the USI Live website at usilive.org. And if you look at the website and you scroll down, on the right hand side of the screen you'll see a box that says Big Blue Button with a drop down menu of meetings. Choose your meeting. So let's say that the meeting that we've decided to have today is called USI Conference. Type in your name, uh, this can be any name that you'd like to be known on um, in the conference, and the password which you have been given by the conference organizer, and you click join, and, and you'll be redirected to the Big Blue Button web conferencing server. So then you'll see a pop-up box which asks to use your camera and microphone. Click the button that says allow and then if you want to check that your headphone or speakers is working, click play test sound. That shows that the sound is working and there should be a default microphone set. If you want to, you can change it. If you have a different microphone plugged in that you'd rather use, you can change that. But you probably won't need to do anything. Once you're happy with that, you just click join audio. We're currently the only person in this conference. And you'll see your name pop up here, which means that you're the first person here and you're in the audio part of the conference. Now, when other people join, you'll see their names appear up in the top left first. And then once they join the audio part of the conference, they'll appear here as well. Your webcam isn't on yet. To switch your webcam on, go to the top left corner, click the camera icon, and you'll see this box come up. In order to publish it so that other people can see it, click start sharing. And now Anyone else who's logged into the conference will be able to see you and you'll be able to see them if they do the same. And you can also move around any of the boxes that you see on the screen. So if there are 10 people in the conference, you can rearrange the, the camera icon so that you can see where everyone is. And now you can participate in the conference by listening and by speaking. And you can also do it by chat. You can see the window over here. And in that window, you can chat and ask questions. And this is very useful sometimes if your connection's not great, maybe people can't hear you clearly. You can type in a question over there. You can also have private chat in these tabs over here by selecting a person's name and sending them a private chat message. The moderator of the conference will have the ability to mute you and to mute other users and the reason for that is so that not everyone speaks at once and causes a lot of feedback so if you've been muted and you'd like to speak you click the hand icon over here a little hand comes up next to your name the moderator knows that you want to speak so the moderator can unmute you and ask you to and ask for your question ask you to speak um, that's all there is to it. It's really quite simple. We hope that you enjoy using BigBlueButton for web conferencing and that you find it useful. All the best.